Good morning, good afternoon and good evening wherever you might be watching this particular video. Today I'm going to talk about footnotes. Footnotes are those little pieces of text that we see at the bottom of pages that uh, will refer generally to numbers up here in the text itself. But before I do that I want to show you a little trick. You'll notice here in the first bullet point that I have an extra line here in that bullet point uh, but it is actually in the same paragraph. A bullet point is simply a paragraph and I can see where I press the enter key by clicking on the paragraph marker here and that shows me these they're like a backward pointing P aren't they? They're where I press the enter key but this this symbol here tells me that I didn't press the enter key here but what I did I used a combination of keystrokes uh, which I'll show you in a moment to um, send this uh, text here down a line but still in the same paragraph. Now you may well know how to do this but if not well I'll show you. So what I'm going to do is to turn the paragraph marker off and uh, I'm going to um, undo an action here and all I need to do, it is so simple, is to hold down the shift key and press enter and there we have it, I'm in the same line so I'll just type it as easy to do so there we go uh, remember that little trick many people um, fret over uh, when they press the enter key at the end of the line here because they want to go down you actually create another bullet point and then they have to backspace to get rid of the bullet point uh, maybe use the space bar to line things up and the, all the printing uh, becomes uh, higgledy piggledy so remember shift and enter keeps you in the same paragraph but down a line and perfectly tabbed here so that the printing is always perfect footnotes what I want to do is to press uh, uh, click the mouse after the text here uh, I'll just press the space bar to space the number out a bit and I'm going to go to the references tab and say in the footnotes uh, group insert footnote and there it inserts the footnote at the bottom of the page with the same number that appears here so what I'll now do is uh, I'll, I'll just type this is footnote number one of course you can type uh, uh, whatever text you want down there uh, now I'm going to insert a second footnote uh, don't click on insert footnote yet you need to tell Word where you want the footnote so I'm going to press the space bar to space it out again and you'll notice that when I click insert footnote it knows that this footnote is the second footnote so I'll say this is footnote number two and I can go on and uh, keep um, uh, adding footnotes I'll add another one for this particular space bar uh, insert footnote there we are down the bottom uh, footnote number three so there we go if I select the footnotes I can format them by bolding or italicizing changing the color etc so the footnotes uh, can be formatted as you wish and uh, hopefully you'll see that it is really quite easy and uh, that's how it's done don't forget to subscribe we would love to have you as a subscriber and any comments you'd like to make are always appreciated so a million thanks for watching bye for now